Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to dye your hair extensions at home. Now, first of all I just brushed them and placed them on some foil and a towel on my table because I wanted to protect everything and not get dye everywhere. Um, the hair dye I'm using actually requires you to dampen the hair before you dye it, so that's what I'm doing there, I'm just spraying some water onto the hair extensions using a spray bottle. Um, the hair dye I'm using is the Casting Creme Colours from L'Oreal in the colour 403 Chocolate Fudge, if anyone's interested. It's just the colour I use on my hair, so I thought it would match it really nicely. Um, I'm just applying it with a brush. Um, you don't have to use a brush. I just find it easier and it gives a neater application. But you can always use your hands. You don't need to go out and buy brushes if you don't want to or a bowl. It's just I have them anyway because that's what I do at college, so I have them anyway. But, um... Yeah, just use your hands. I would have used my hands if I didn't have the bowl or brush or anything like that. So you just use what you have. You don't have to buy anything else. Um, yeah, so I would just apply it throughout the whole hair. Make sure you get it up right near the grips because you don't want to leave any patchy areas. You might have noticed that I just turned the hair around. Um, that's to make sure that there's a nice even application throughout the whole of the hair. You don't want to have those horrible patchy bits of hair when you want it to blend nicely so that's what I did then I rubbed it in to um, again just make sure it was even and that there was no patchy parts and throughout the whole thing you just want to repeat the process I just showed you really on all of the hair pieces that you've got the whole set then you want to rinse the product out after the time that your dye wants you to keep it in I left mine in for 20 minutes and then I ran it under the cold tap which was a bad choice um, I know you're not meant to use a cold water to rinse it out with on hair extensions because you want to keep them like well looked after but I couldn't do it, it was too cold for me and I couldn't do it for the whole of the hair so I had to revert to going to the shower to use slightly warmer water and that's what I ended up doing after that you just want to lay all the pieces out on a towel um, to air dry, you don't really want to use a hair dryer if you don't have to, just leave that to when you want to style it to keep, again, keep the life of the hair extensions. That's it for the video, if you have any questions please leave them below and I will speak to you all soon, bye!